Sweet. Hello everyone, today we're going to be attempting to learn the Blue Devils 2024 snare break. If you're new here, my name is Henry Yanez. I am a professional snare drummer based out of Southern California. I work with a few booking companies. I work with Disneyland, uh, Sidewall Entertainment, uh, Rhythm of LA, and uh, Street Drum Corps. I've been able to do a lot of really cool gigs out here. Uh, but in the gig world, we don't really chop out the way that the DCI kids do in these days. You know, in the gig world, uh, some of the stuff we play, even the harder stuff, doesn't even scratch the surface of some of the world class stuff that's being played. So today I'm actually going to be pushing myself, pushing my chops, and I'm going to attempt to learn a 2024 Blue Devil snare break. Before we get started, I do want to give a big shout out to Rhythm of LA uh, for lending me this snare. This is a Ludwig snare. Uh, it was provided and we're sponsored by Ludwig Percussion. So this group is a Ludwig sponsored group. Uh, we have the gray top, we have the yellow bottom, the gray Evans hybrid top, the yellow bottom, and then I actually have a pair of Skojos right now. It's actually my pa favorite pair of sticks ever made, the Fire Grain Skojos. So Skojo, if you watch this, you should definitely send me some. Uh, but yeah, I definitely love the sound of the snare. Uh, Try to match it as much as I could to the BD video as well. I hope it sounds great when I put it together. But anyways, uh, let's get to learning. So yeah, uh, I think some of the hardest parts of this snare break uh, is this triple of passes with some buzzes. Uh, I just, I think it's very, I'm not sure. Actually, I'm learning like kind of like the early season one, which is the one that I can find the sheets for. Uh, but this measure, uh, it's just a triple eight bass measure and it just has a bunch of random buzzes I struggled with so much. I can't even play right now. Uh, but I just put the sheets there and I told, I'm, I just really, really struggled with that. Uh, but that's something I really, really struggle with. I thought it was really hard, and it's really hard to get fast. Especially into those uh, 60 notes. And there's just, like a random five lit uh, paradiddle diddle in there with the uh, ends of like two 16 downs that leads into like a five. Uh, I had a lot of trouble learning that. Honestly, I don't even think I have the timing there right, but it is a transcription, so I'm not sure if that is correct. Uh, and then the last thing I definitely struggle with is my old man hands could not uh, keep the speed on those on that last roll. Anyways, uh, yeah, I mean, I, it was definitely a challenge to learn this one. I, like I said, I really hope to continue to learn other things and uh, start putting my chops up. In the gig world, I'm gonna be completely honest, we don't play anything close to a remotely plus as hard. Uh, the last gig I did, I think that we just, it was majority of the time was playing. much uh, more is less in the gig world so learning stuff like <laughs> probably never happened we're gonna be honest with you but I love to push myself so let me know if you want me to learn anything else uh, hit me up on Instagram follow me on Instagram if you want to check out what I do on a day-to-day I uh, do a lot of fun drum work uh, I you know a lot of people are not able to do this after the age down their DCI but I've been very very lucky enough to continue this activity after the age of 21 I aged out two years ago uh, but I still continue to drum and learn every single day. So uh, let's get it and hope you guys are able to learn this too. Uh, the sheets will be down below and I'll see you guys next time.